In this video, I'm going to show you how you can make gradient mesh wallpapers like these in Figma. And because Figma is a web-based app and can be used from your browser, you can follow this tutorial from your phone as well. Just go to figma.com, sign up and follow along. First, we're going to install a plugin in Figma. To do so, click the profile logo and go to community. Search for mesh gradient and install it. Go back and either create a new document or open an existing one. It doesn't really matter. You can see I've created a bunch of these already. You can download all of these on my Twitter for free and there will be some special edition ones in my icon pack Reef Pro as well. So be sure to check them out from the link in the description. Alright, so click the Figma logo, go to plugins and then select mesh gradient. It'll take a couple seconds to load but once it's loaded, you'll see this dialog window. Here you can play around with the settings to get the desired look you want. You can create one or multiple mesh points, select your colors, enable line visibility for extra precision, and you can save your mesh for later use which is pretty neat. Once you're happy with your mesh, click the 1x text to select the output resolution. Here's a little cheat sheet I made for all of them. Each one has their own use but 5x makes the most sense for wallpaper so that's what we're going to select for today. After that click generate and you'll have your wallpaper added onto your document. And you can now close the plugin window. Now you must be thinking these are not the right dimensions for a wallpaper. And you will be right so let's fix that. Make sure your mesh is selected. On the right hand side you will see dimensions of the mesh rectangle. Change it to whatever aspect ratio your screen has. Mine is 16 by 9 so I'll keep my height and set my width to 1440. To change the crop area, click the crop icon at the top and move it around until you're happy with it. When it's time to export, click the plus icon next to the export on the right, set it to JPEG or PNG, whichever one you like, export it and set it as your wallpaper. If you want to see more design tutorials, click the card above and be sure to subscribe for more videos like this in the future. Also join the Discord if you want to show off your designs, Thank you so much for watching, I will see you in the next video, peace out.